Hey there peeps, Mimi here and welcome back to Dragalia Lost. Today we are going to be doing some summons on this banner. What will we get? So the question is, what do I want out of this banner? I would like Louise. I don't have a 5 star Bowman. I only have one other 5 star wind unit and that's Maribel and I love Maribel. Me just is where it's at in my opinion because I really like playing as a mage and you know it would be nice to also get Lowen because I don't have a wind healer and he would you know, be a nice round out. I do think that you know almost all teams do need a healer you know even when you're playing co-op it's always nice to have a healer to make sure you stay alive and you know this isn't any exception it, it's it's nice to have and you know sometimes you can be a powerhouse and don't need a you know a healer to like you know help you out but you know when you do it's nice to have one but anyways in the summon run we do have the appearance rates for four you know five stars is at four percent and it increases every 10 times you summon and this is 10 total summoning units like each one so if you do a 10 summon it'll increase because that was 10 summons. Then we have for featured adventurers is 2%, or almost 2%, and the featured um, four stars. And if you keep scrolling, you can see which units have a rate up. For right now, Louise has a rate up, of course, for the five stars. Garuda has a five star, you know, has a summon rate reader because, you know, the banner. And the new Wind Prince also has summon rate. For four star adventurers, uh, Lowen has it um, the rate up and rock has it uh, for the four star dragons and for reference we have the new ones here well, actually no it's not uh, such the anvil and fresh perspective are not new um actually first perspective is but such the anvil is not and they have a rate up right now pierto and the three star adventurers has a rate up so you know there's always units that are trickled here and there that have some rate ups so we will see what we get I currently have 12 summon tickets and I do have a 10 summon ticket because we did get one as a perk for this event so you can see my summon voucher here and a tenfold summon voucher so we're gonna collect everything just so you know we can do this and we will we'll see what we get so you can see I have my 10 summon voucher ticket and I also have the 13 tickets that I have so we're gonna go through these and then based on what we get we will see if we use my warm mind so let's go here is my first tenfold summon how will it go how will it go I have no clue y'all know what kind of luck I have we just had a bird pass so that's probably a four star yes four star so we got three four stars in the summon but you know hey they could always change always change is, you know, hopefully it would be a unit that changes. So in this one we have, oh, I don't have this dragon. It's Turbog. Hi. Where do I? I don't recall. Garita's feather is nice because, you know, one of the things that I wanted to summon for is the Worm Prince, just to get that extra boost right off the bat when it comes to this event. Fresh perspective. This is so cute. It's adorable. We got some Eldwater. Some more elder water. We need all the elder. We need all the elder water. Oh. Um, oh, we got the new guy, Pietro. I, now I just like said it like some other way. Howling Predator, and we got more elder water. Oh, cause we got Pietro. No, who's this? I wanted to know who you were, but I apparently have you already, but hi. Um, and we wanted to see this, because it's so cute. And also, I don't want to see the details, because I forget his name. Nope. No, it doesn't say. I Maybe I need more to like unlock the rest of the details. Because I always forget his name, and I don't want to go to my units to figure out who he is. Um, just because I can't remember his name for like the life of me. Actually, it's bothering me. Let's quickly go look at what his name is, cause... 
Renzal. Renzal. Because you have such an easy name. Such an easy name. Okay, so now let's do my single summons. I do have 13 tickets, so we're just going to use them all. And because we already did 10 summons, um, our rate of has increased. Kind of my goal is to save summon tickets from one event to use on the next event and see how they, you know, they fare. And here we got the, a four star win print, which is not interesting. And I do want to check that, yes, the, the rates did change. So let's keep going. Let's go through all of these 12 tickets. <gasps> oh my God, we got the dragons. Come on. Oh my God. Oh my God, what did we get? Don't tell me it's a win print. Yes, it's a win print. I mean, it's beautiful. I mean, don't get me wrong. The art on this is beautiful. Full HP, strength plus 10%, critical damage plus 10%. It is not a bad worm print. It's beautiful. But I wanted a unit. So we're gonna, oops. I did my daily deal instead of my single summon, I think. Oh my gosh. The worm prints, they get to me. I mean, they're nice. I, I you know, a lot of worm prints have very good skills associated with them. But, you know, I would like five-star unit, adventure unit, even a five-star dragon. Watch the next thing I get is a five-star dragon. So we got a worm print, revolutionary magic. She's so cute. Althea is like so adorable. And what does this one do? Just because it's new. Full HP, skill damage plus 25%, and paralysis resist. All these resists are very helpful, especially like as you go into different events. You know, you might need uh, Prowl's Resist or Stun or, you know, depending on what the boss is afflicting on you. And more room prints. Uh, Trove of Knowledge. I think I already have this one, yes. And so we're going to keep going. But really, the troll of that five star, I got... <clears throat> And it's not even one of the new room prints. Oh my gosh. I tell you, it trolls me. Lake Scythe. Okay. Single summon. All these summons. Another room print. These worm prints really like me. Like, at this point, I feel like the worm prints are like, Mew Mew, we're just gonna troll you because you don't like us. Like, I do partially believe them, but that's just going on here. But uh, hey, we at least got an adventure this time. Like, that is progress. <laughs> but, like, oh, look, it's. It's Nudiho's waifu. Let's go look at, has our rates increased? Appearance rates, three more before they increase. So they'll increase before the last ticket. And then we'll do a 10 summon. Just cause it's so triggering that, you know, all these worm prints. She's adorable. I just, I gotta say. She's we already have her, but she's adorable. Choo, 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 choo. What have y'all gotten on these summons? Like, uh, if you look back at all my summon videos for Dragon Laws and even other games, my luck is sometimes not there with me. Like, I'm not trying to think of like, when has my luck been there? <laughs> but you know, sometimes I get some good summons. Sometimes I get things to be envied, like not too often, but yeah. So my appearance rates just increased. So we got two more summoning tickets, and then we'll do a 10 summon to see what we can get. I still haven't gotten Lowen. I haven't gotten Louise. I would like 
at least one of them. If, you know, game, it's not too much to ask that you give me one of the units for free. Maybe seven tickets. But I guess it was a lot to ask, so we have to dig into my Walmart. I like doing the daily summons when there's new banners. Um, so actually I am done with my summon tickets. That has already been 23 summons because of the tenfold summon ticket and because of my 13 tickets. So we are at appearance rates, eight more before we get increased five star rates. So let's see what we get. We are guaranteed a four star or above and let's do this. We got some birds flying. <gasps> oh my gosh, so two four stars and there's a five star. Dragon, five star dragon. And there was a staff. Oh my gosh. Is the dragon a five star? Fresh perspective, another one. Got, you know, some for my whole team. I'm like, oh my, I'm, I'm anxious now. Like, what did we get? What did we get? What did we get? I mean, other than a lot of Eld Water. Which, hey, we need a lot of Eld Water. If you haven't seen my promo um, how to promote units video, you should go watch that. It's very helpful, I think. And, you know, it tells you why you need Eld Water. <gasps> yes! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! I wanted her so bad in the last banner and I pulled for her and I didn't get her. Thank you, servers, for finally gracing me. Oh my gosh, girl. You are so cute. You are so adorable. Oh my gosh. Finally, girl. And we got Loen. Okay. I am very happy with this summon. I am very happy. I mean, I might have not gotten Louise that's okay i got her brother so maybe she'll come one day and i got cerberus i got cerberus that's all that matters wow welcome homegirl welcome i mean for hide midgard she'd be great and you know any win base event that you know you need flame for she doesn't even have a raid up like that is how ridiculous my luck is sometimes so I'm very happy, I'm very happy, I, I can't lie, I'm very happy. We got some wind grass, uh, wind whistle grass, and Loen. I will definitely put you putting him in my team. I'm very happy. So that is all my summons. I, I can't go further because there's no way I can compete with a summon. Let me know in the comments below, what did you think of my summons? Were they good? Were they not good? And let me know what you have gotten out of your summons. Thank you all so very much for watching. And until next time, meow to meow.